Hi, we're here once again with Wendy Rose Williams. She is a past life energy healer and she trained with some of the world's most renowned healing experts, including Dr. Brian Weiss. And she also studied with uh, some of the uh, disciples of uh, Dolores Cannon and Michael Newton. Hi, Wendy. So how are you? I'm doing great. Thank you so much for having me back. It's wonderful to be here. I'd like to talk about the uh, past life regression. What is a uh, past life regression? Uh, in, in, in short words, uh, what would you tell someone who doesn't know about it? What would you say? Sure. What, what past life regression is, you can think of it as a way of working with a practitioner to relax and to start to get in touch with your own soul wisdom across all your lifetimes. You can think of it as a type of a, of a guided meditation, perhaps is a good way a lot of people can kind of, kind of understand and visualize what's going on, where there's some positive suggestions being given to you to help you release energy that doesn't serve you anymore. Pain, anxiety, and depression being three of the big examples. Um, I've had people who have had a common one is fear of water and just, you know, not being comfortable of being in like dark waters or not comfortable putting their head under, or some people it could be so bad they don't even want to go in the water. Um, and it, it typically correlates to a past life drowning or having been, um, you know, pushed under or sucked under the water or having gone over a waterfall. Um, or different things like that that led to a death. So that, that's what can go on there. One that comes to mind, AJ, that was really compelling was a gal with a fear of heights. And her fear of heights was, was so intense, she couldn't go hiking um, with her fiance because she never knew he'd have to like go ahead and really check out a trail and make sure there was no elevation at all or she wouldn't be able to do the hike. She was petrified of travel because when she'd get to the um, airport, she couldn't go up and down the escalators to get to the different levels. She would have to go find the elevator because she couldn't be on that open space and you know see over the escalator. And what we found during her past life regression session with me where we worked one-on-one -on -one, what we found was actually a rather lovely life, um, a rather idyllic life until the death scene. And what she had done, she had been very close to nature. She'd been a male, she was outside and in the woods and just pretty idyllic, as I said, but she laid down on the side of a river bank and was just taking a, a lovely nap there and some sort of um, a group of men came upon her and robbed her, um, hit her on the head and rolled her into that water and she remembered falling off this river bank. Interestingly, she did not have a fear of water in this lifetime, but for her it was all about the height and the fear of the heights. So when we found that, and she's like, oh my goodness, that's what happened. I hadn't consciously remembered it, but I was able to say to her, that was then, and this is now. And I'm so sorry that happened to you, but you know, let's look at that life, the big picture. She's like, that was a pretty amazing life that explains you know, why I love to go hiking and why I love to go in the woods but this fear of heights. And so she looked like a new woman when she left and her fiance had actually driven her and brought her to the appointment. And they just walked off hand in hand. They were an older couple, it was just very sweet. And I got in touch with her about a week later. I said, how are you doing? How are you feeling? She said, you won't believe it. We're able to go anywhere we want now. We can hike, we can travel, I can get on airplanes. I take the escalator. She said, you've opened up my life again. It's like, well, <laughs> you, you did that. I'm just happy, I'm happy you got to be the facilitator with you. It was wonderful. Okay, so it's been really nice having you. Well, thank you so much, AJ. It was my pleasure. Thanks again. Thank you so much, AJ, and to your listeners. Thank you.
Bye.